camera and just plopped off. My camera just fell off and I thought I was done with YouTube forever. Hi. Hi, Hannah. How are you? Today we're going to be reviewing your collab with Midas. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Anna and this is my channel called For the Love of Glitter. Today I am excited and proud to get to review the Midas collaboration, Midas Cosmetics with Smoky Glow. You might be wondering who are who is this brand? Who is this person? I actually am currently an affiliate with Midas Cosmetics and for anything on their store you can use my code which is just glitter in all caps. This code will save you 20% on everything except for sale items. If by the end of the video you're like I do really want to get this palette you can use that and save 20% off. It is an affiliate code which means I do make a small percentage from whatever you do purchase but you also get saved 20% off and if you do use my code thank you so much in advance. So Smoky Glow is a YouTuber here and she is a part of the beauty community and she did a pretty large collab with Midas Cosmetics and they did reveal it back in like January I think and I was so excited from the moment they revealed it because I saw this pink sparkly packaging and I was like I need to see the inside and when they did reveal the inside I was like did I make this palette because it looks like that would be something that I would come up with myself so I was pretty darn excited for she did come out with a palette and it looks like this it does have 18 shades it has very beautiful pink glitters on it I'm actually not going to do the demo in here I'm gonna do a three looks in one video for you guys so you can see the different types of look you can get using this palette it does have a mirror which says hi friends because that's how she kind of opens up it's her YouTube intro and inside you get a variety of pinks and a little bit of purples and some very wearable shades as well I love the variety in this palette the color story is so beautiful to me I think it's so easy to use it would be very easy to wear for a lot of different occasions this palette, I will have to look up the prices. I will put them down below. It is very affordable. Everything on Midas is super affordable. Upon using this, I will say some of the shades I did struggle with just a little bit. For instance, yesterday I used Warrior and it was... Um, some of them are so soft and they kind of apply a little slightly patchy, um, but you just kind of have to build it up and work with it a little bit more. My absolute favorite thing in this palette are the shimmers, especially I love the duochromes. Um, for instance, here is Leno, and Leno is pressed very, um, they're pressed very, almost like if you've used the new ColourPop, uh, very delicate shimmer intense metallic shades are kind of pressed the same way so they're very fragile but oh my gosh do you see that duochrome goodness this is like almost worth it just for these duochromes my favorite shade oh my gosh is nutty and it doesn't look that interesting in pan but when you swatch it it's like pink and blue or purple I don't know it's like the most the coolest shade I have ever seen and the, like these are definitely my favorites like the shimmers I haven't used this one yet but I know it's gonna be a favorite too it's called group chat and it's a beautiful pink with um gold sparkles so these are like my favorite things about the palettes are the shimmers specifically the very duochrome shimmers I feel like sometimes indie brands will sell these separately these types of shades for like eight sometimes $20 a pop so to get it in a whole palette with a lot of other colors for a pretty good price I think it's worth it honestly um they're just so good and so intense and so buttery and soft and it's not like those duochromes that have too much of a white cast like they're really good um sometimes since they are a little bit more toppery like the purple one I do like to use it wet just to really make it stick together. It's what I have in my center of the lid today and it worked beautifully. Yesterday I used Nutty. Oh, it's so pretty. I can't wait to use this shade and this light gold shade. I just, 
this palette is going to get used for sure and for the price point I think it's a really great buy the next thing is a highlighting palette it again has the beautiful I think that this outer packaging is more sparkly so it's even more intense and beautiful um, it is a little bit smaller but you do get two shades and it does have a mirror also so this would be great for travel we're actually going to Hawaii this summer this might be what I pack because you kind of have the pink or gold option today I did use the pink one and it was super intense they're super buttery super soft like they're so soft they almost feel like a super shock shadow but they're not they're definitely powders but they're so so pretty um, and it will get used uh, I, th I think it's pretty and I like it I'll use it so there is the highlighter um, I do use it in the demo as well and lastly she came out with three lip glosses which might be one of my favorite things this one is called sparkle on and this one is like a rose gold this one is your glittery lip topper so it's just going to give you more glitter and it does have like a flat doe foot applicator which I really like the applicators on this so there is that super glittery and I'm actually going to swatch it next to Joey's lip topper in rose gold because they look almost identical to me as soon as I used this one I was like this looks just like the Joey lip topper in rose gold so here is Joey's lip topper in rose gold um, looking at them side by side, of course this was just like off the top of my head, this is my first time seeing them compared. The Jouer one is definitely a little bit more darker in the tube, so we'll see. Um, the Jouer one does have a different scent, these smoky glow ones do kind of have like a strawberry or a cherry scent, I can't really put my finger on it. Um, but I actually like the applicator of the Midas one better because it is flat. But I like the smell of the Jouer ones better because it is like that vanilla cupcake scent which is amazing I don't know how similar they really will be it's just when I saw it it reminded me of it so the Jouer one is definitely darker on the darker side but I feel like they sparkle just as much um, and I do like the color of the smoky glow one better than I do the Jouer one but the Jouer one smells I mean it smells like it smells good. They're both very comfortable on the lips as well. And then this one is the Jouer one. So both super duper sparkly. The next one is what I have on top of a lip product today. This one's called Never Dull. And then this one is better for like a mauve nude lip. It, when you put it on top of like a mauve color, it just kind of looks a little bit sparkly it doesn't add too much and it looks really pretty on its own too it just gives you a little more something something than a clear gloss but nothing too too crazy so there it is um it just has a slight shimmer so as you can tell it's not like this other one over here which is super glittery and intense um this one's just kind of like a barely there type of shimmer and the last one is super duper pigmented um, it is like this bright coral red color, which honestly, at first I wasn't super excited for the shade just because I don't really re wear red colors. This one is called High Friends, but I think this shade will be beautiful in the summertime, like when you're getting your tan on and you just use the fresh face look and just have this on your lips, I think it's going to look stunning like this is probably something I'll bring with me to Hawaii as well just to have like a pop of color but you don't have to work too hard for color on your lips I mean it's pigmented I wore it yesterday she's pigmented are you ready are you ready holy smokes like she's so pigmented to the point that you can almost classify this as a um, liquid lip like I feel like these glosses are the perfect consistency they stick just enough so that they stay on but they're not super sticky and I will get a lot of use out of these and again the price is just right and I think they're gonna eventually sell these separately so if there's only one color or two colors you like then you know go check it out um, but they do come in a bundle and I actually I forgot to show you all the outer packaging this is the outer packaging for the palette it completely 
doesn't match the inner packaging, which I don't care because I don't really keep outer packaging anyways. Um, here's the outer packaging for, so you kind of have like this taupey kind of mood going on for the outer packaging. And um, a little note from Hannah. I don't know why it makes me feel like I want to cry after reading this note. During their whole launch, they did have problems with the coronavirus. Um, they actually could not get their products sent to them because of the coronavirus. And so since we had to wait a little bit longer, it was completely out of their hands. So I understood and I felt like they updated everyone pretty well. They sent out a mass email and um, they said if you decide to keep your order you will be getting a little free makeup bag and it says hi friends and it has smoky glow times minus on the back. It is very like thin and flimsy but what's really cool about it is the whole entire collection fits into this bag even when it's packaged. I had the lip glosses in it and it just all fits in there. Even, even the palette you guys. The palette is not that small either. <laughs> And um, all up glasses, and then you still have quite a bit of space. I don't know, this might be coming to Hawaii with me too. Um, so it was really nice they included that because they definitely didn't have to. It was just out of their something completely out of their hands. So that to me is a company going above and beyond of what they really had to do. That's all I have to say about this collection. What are your favorite things from it? I think mine are the glosses. I also really do like the palette, especially the duochromes from the palette. Um, I will be doing, uploading a three looks in one with the palette, so stay tuned for that. You guys have a great day. Thank you so much for watching, and please don't, for, please don't forget to subscribe if this was helpful to you. Bye.